Hi, I'm Owen Henney. You're watching Ready to Renovate with Builders and Private Property. Well, the kitchen is considered the heart of a home. Let's show you how we took it from where it was to where it is now. Let's take a look. We had a clear idea what we wanted to do with this kitchen and a 3D design was a great way to test our vision before we brought it to life. You can see that the floors, walls and cupboards and basically everything was worn and outdated. Often townhouse kitchens have got absolutely no personality, they're white melamine cupboards. That's the one thing I wanted to prevent. For the results we wanted, we couldn't work with any of this and opted to strip everything to give us a fresh start. Always get your measurements correct. Another thing to consider is how certain fittings impact others. This coordination is important. Once we had a clean canvas, we were able to start this new build by moving systematically from the floor where we laid these large concrete look tiles to the bland white tiles that were refreshed with these white subway wall tiles in a stylish herringbone pattern. Jean, we're in the kitchen at the moment and this is an area either for pantry or for fridge. But these walls, hmm, I don't know. I'm sure Amanda wanted them also gone. What was the design she, idea with this? She did. She wanted it gone. She wanted an open feel walking in. However, Body Corporate decided against it. Um, apparently this is a structural wall and it's not allowed to be moved. Something else you need to consider is to check for stock shortages. These beautiful countertops were actually our second option after our granite supplier had no stock and we just couldn't wait. The new cupboards and accessories finish off this contemporary masterpiece. Once we had tiled the floor, we had to wait for the cabinets to be installed before we could complete the backsplash. Another challenge we encountered was with this feature wall. This is why you need an experienced contractor to help you, so mishaps don't become total disasters. And these custom-made blinds create a lovely backdrop. But just remember to check the lead times for delivery of custom-made items, as this could create delays. Hi John, what's up? <laughs> Hi Amanda, um, sorry, we're in the kitchen at this stage, I'm the extractor fan. A little bit of an issue. The, the fan that was chosen um, shows a canopy hood that needs to be installed to the outside of the building in order for it to function properly. Um, however, we're on the ground unit and there's no way of us core drilling through to the unit above. So we'll have to change the extractor to maybe one of the hooded, hooded lenses. Um, I just want to know if that is possible. May I send you photos of something that they have in store that we can use? Would that be, would that be fine with you? Yes, if that is a technical issue, then we have to go with what you suggest. Um, just make sure it looks very contemporary, preferably back. Otherwise, trouble about straight lines. Go straight lines, perfect. Once I'm at Builders, I'll send you a couple of photos. Thank you, ma'am. Okay, thank cool. you. Bye. Bye-bye. Download the Get It Done app, where you'll find a host of vetted home renovation specialists. The Builders Gift Registry app can bring in family and friends to help fund your renovation. It is also a great way to track and manage the materials that your contractor is buying for your project. The kitchen came with its own set of problems. The countertop, wood, as well as the extractor fan were the main concerns. We ended up going for the secondary options. And I must say, the look and feel does come out in the end. So the kitchen, I really like the way it came out. It is um, better than anticipated. For me, the challenge was obviously it's a townhouse, it's a very tiny kitchen. So we want, I wanted to add as much storage space, space as possible. So we added an extra cupboard or two. We also extended the, the, the top um, to create a breakfast nook. Out with the 80s and in with everything contemporary. From cabinets to fittings and appliances. Look at these stylish black Lusso taps. We extended the countertop to create this neat breakfast nook and added some storage space underneath. Like what you see in this kitchen? 
tell you what, I do. And you can catch all the episodes of the Ready to Renovate with Builders and Private Property episodes on the Builders and Private Property website, as well as on the online channels. And don't forget that Builders is your one-stop destination for all things DIY and home improvement. Get to Builders, get it done.